So there they are in hibernation. But they are coming out today. See what? There they are. There's some of them. But as you can see, there have been casualties. There have been casualties. But we will see. So it's time. Now they are officially out of hibernation. It is now ant season, guys. Here we are back here. Before, before, yeah, before I set them up, I need to get them used to just room temperature. So I'm gonna give a voiceover from here because in the original video, my voice is a little bit distressed. I can't have you guys hearing that. So here's my Messer Bouvery. They're my seedier ants, they're my easiest. There was loads of them. And I f the hibernate, the fridge killed them basically, innit? So here's a little clip of the dead bodies. So enough of that sadness, let's get back to the video. So here's my either pavement ants or their fire ants. I got them in a social distanced ant deal at the start of last year. <laughs> My first ant deal. Oh. Then we move on to my Lignipurda, my Campanus Lignipurda, the massive, biggest ones out of them all. They come from like France or Spain or something. So there's six workers there, but then Five of them just decided to die. I don't know if it was to do with hibernation. Then we got my fire ants here. It's like a six queen colony. Look at that. Look at the beautiful larvae there. You see that? Okay. Put that down then. So they've got a little nice. I don't even really see them too tough. They come up in the night. When I go and see, try to see them, they're like, nah, not having it. So here's my Lassius Niger, the black garden ants you see over here. The colony was massive again. Fridge killed half of them. Look, look at all those dead bodies. Look, look at it. That's a mass graveyard. Cha. Might have to clean that. Look at that. Clean now. And I forgot about my Lassius Flavus. So here they are. You see them in your garden as well. They, these ones, they killed the queen, I think. Or it just died because it just did. But yeah, they'll probably end up being my biggest colony in the end. So we we'll just have to see. So this myself. Just taking up two shelves at the moment, but it's due to take up more. So I've fed them some, some stuff. Some honey water, some sugar water and that. So we're going to go to the nest now before I show you a little clip of what they used to be. They're growing, you know. Bit of growth. Larvae, we've got pupae as well. The queen's there with her wings. Just can't be bothered to take them off really. Just a bit lazy, that's what it is. But yeah, I'm going to show you a clip of what they used to be when I was feeding them. It's a bit of a mad thing still. Here we go. I don't have to say no more except from subscribe for more updates. You know what it is. Life of Kush.